data blocks are the fundamental building blocks of an Oracle database. This is the smallest unit of I.O. that a database instance can request for. What is a data block? It is what is formatted and kept in data files. You must have looked at my video on table spaces and data files in which I told you when a data file is created, Oracle instance formats them in the form of Oracle blocks. An Oracle block is one or more operating system blocks. The operating system has no clue about how many operating system blocks makes an Oracle block because that is defined within the database. When you create a database, there is a parameter it's called as DB block size. Whatever you set in this is called as the standard block size. By default, any table space you create follows this block size. Any table you put in this table space obviously has the same block size. But you also have non-standard block sizes. What you set in the parameter DB block size is called as the standard block size. Whereas when you create table spaces in an Oracle database, you have a choice of specifying a block size for the table space, which means this table space alone would follow a particular block size pattern. Why is that so? The typical use case is if you are doing a transportable table space, you might want to have a table space from another database to be plugged into a, your database. Then if that database had a different block size compared to your database, you should still support it. That's where it comes in of help. By default, the standard block size blocks come to the DB cache, which is your standard block size. DB cache size that you set is organized as per the standard block size of a database. What about those table spaces which are having a non-standard block size? You need to set up separate cache sizes for them like DB 2K cache size, 4K cache size, 8K cache size, 16K cache size and 32K cache size. Five options are there but one of them would anyway be used as the default block. So let's say your database has a default block size of 4K. Then you have a choice of setting 2 or 8 or 16 or 32 non-default cache sizes. Any data kept in a table space which is in a non-default block size will be read into that cache only. Database block size can be 2K, 4K, 8K, 16K or 32K. What does a database block contain? It has a header and finally has data that you put into your table or index data. I have another video in which I will tell you more details about how a block is organized and how a row is organized.